Hey everyone, it's Ashley. Um, here for my three week post op update. Um, I don't have a lot to say um, because there's not much going on. But I had uh, a doctor's appointment on Tuesday. And um, from the last time I went there, it was just two weeks, I had lost eight pounds um, on their scale. So that's. 19 pounds on their scale that I'd lost since I've lost since surgery, which is great. Um, and I'm very happy that I'm down that amount. Um, but I'm kind of frustrated because my scale at home, I mean the scale basically, hasn't moved since like a week. For like a week. Um, I've stayed at between 230, I keep saying that. 285 and 287. Um <clears throat> and it's really frustrating and I sh I didn't weigh myself this morning because I need to stop weighing myself every day. Um but it's just so frustrating to see the same numbers around the same numbers for a long time. Um and I don't know if I am not eating enough. Um, I don't know if I'm not exercising enough. Um, I just don't know right now. Um, which reminds me, I should call my doctor's office. I think that I'm going to talk to the uh, nutritionist and see what uh, they have to say. That the amount of calories I should be eating at this stage, um, that type of thing. Um, I don't think there's much else to say. Uh, I, today I went to the gym and did, um, 17 minute mile. I jogged and walked and jogged and walked. Um, and then another about five or so minutes just like as it cooled down. Um, I went back to aqua aerobics. I'm super excited. I love aqua aerobics so much. If anybody out there has the ability to go and do it, sorry, I look awful. Um, you should totally do it. It's like mm, super, super fun. There's, you know, great music, at least with the one I go to. Um, there's super great music, and everybody's really supportive, and I'm only 25, so I'm definitely the youngest person that goes there, um, and the oldest is probably probably in their 70s, um, and there isn't much middle ground. Um, it's like me, and then the next oldest, youngest person is probably like 40. But it's great. Uh, they're super supportive, and I wasn't able to go there for a while when I had a job. And then after I had my son, I wasn't able to go. But anytime I come back, they're just like, hey, Ashley, we're so glad to have you back. Um, and it's super fun, and it's really low impact, and you feel great afterwards. You've done this amazing workout, and you don't feel like you've just burned as many calories as you have. Um, what was I going to say? I did it, this is, um, so this is my, I was almost three weeks, I went on Tuesday, I was almost three weeks out, uh, and I did have a little bit of muscle pain, sorry, I just look awful, I can't see, I'm looking at my though. um, I did have a little amount of muscle pain right near where my port was, just because we were doing a lot of ab exercises um and but it's gone away um and so i'm super happy i went back um definitely definitely check it out if you have the chance like i i literally sweat well in the water um because we're moving around so much then we do we do like 30 minutes of cardio it's an hour long class 30 minutes of cardio then like we did, um, this week we did some sprints. So you start wherever you are and then you run, to run, jog, walk really fast. Because it's hard in the water. Um, to, to the end of the pool, which it obviously gets shallower. And then you go back and forth. So we did 30 seconds, 45 seconds, and then a minute of jogging. 
um, <clears throat> which they call sprints, and then you do like a cool down where you just like lunges and side to side back and forth from the pool. Then we went down to the deep end, which is super deep. It's a really big pool. So I think it's like, like 10 or 12 feet deep. It's real. It's, it's a big pool. Um, and you take the weights. We, we, first we did weights under the water, like styrofoam weights. Then we went down to the deep end and did some more like ab workout. <clears throat> and you can do those like without the without b dumbbells you could just do it at your local pool too um um <clears throat> and then we do like a really like cooled cool down stretching out stuff like that and then it's done but it's an amazing workout and i highly recommend it for anybody uh, especially larger people because it's not so hard on your joints um and you do, you do get a really good workout without feeling like you're gonna die, <laughs> basically. Uh, um, and I think that's about it. I've been trying some, like, band-friendly meals. Um, we had these um, stuffed peppers, and if I can try and figure it out, I will put the link uh, at the bottom of this video. I'm not really that great at this, so maybe. Uh, but they were called Philly, che Philly Cheese Steak Stuffed Peppers, and they were so good. And I am not a leftover person, <clears throat> but I had I had one, like it was a half, you slice them in half, so it was one half um, on Wednesday. Then I had, for for dinner, then I had one for lunch yesterday and one for dinner yesterday. And I thought about having one for lunch today, but I actually ate some lunch meat instead. So, um, but they're really, really good, and I'll try and put the link at the bottom. Um, okay, so everybody have a really great weekend. Bye.